Andres Gutierrez is live to show us why these road closures are needed. Andres? Well, there, Mark. Hey there, Mark. The, this is it, actually. It's about two stories high, and it weighs nearly half a million pounds. This massive transformer was actually brought to us via train from Mexico, where it was built. The company from Kentucky, the Edwards Moving and Rigging Company, will actually be hauling this transformer. And as you can see, it is securely fastened to this trailer that has 36 axles. Everything that you see here runs on hydraulics. And far off into the distance, you could actually see that there are concrete bags that will serve as a counterweight to this uh, overall move later tonight. Starting at 11 tonight, this massive transformer will make its way to KCPNL's Nashua substation located at U.S. Highway 169 and 132nd Street near Smithville. This piece is part of an important upgrade at the substation and is expected to improve the reliability to the overall power grid. A spokeswoman with KCPNL wouldn't disclose the cost of this transformer, but tells me that on average, a piece like this is worth between two to four million dollars. The move is expected to last at least eight hours tonight, and the maximum speed here will be 10 miles per hour. Reporting live in Liberty, I'm Andres Gutierrez, 41 Action News. Well, here is a look at the road closures that are coming up tonight. I-35 from 152 Highway to 291 Highway will shut down in both directions for about 90 minutes. 435 between 152 and 169 will close for up to four hours. Traffic will then detour to 152 and 169 to bypass that closure. Traffic restrictions begin tonight at 7 o'clock.